Hello and welcome, dear students of the fourth grade of primary school, in a new lesson of communication and information technology lessons entitled Synchronous and Asynchronous Communication. Lesson objectives discuss with teachers and colleagues the use of synchronous and asynchronous communication. Communicate with others using digital tools. Discuss how to announce results using digital tools. Let's interact together. Think about your findings from the digital research you did earlier. How you can present this information to your teacher using appropriate digital tools. Online communication. The internet allows us to communicate synchronously which is great for having conversations to check on people who live far away from us. Synchronous communication is not always a good thing. Sometimes we have to give ourselves or others enough time to think the information we have sent. So it is important to know when to use each type of communication. When is synchronous communication appropriate? When information is urgent or need to move quickly between friends and close family members. When the answer does not require much thought and preparation. When information revolves around issues of everyday life. Asynchronous communication. When is asynchronous communication appropriate? When information matters but not urgent. Among the people who do not know each other well. When the answer needs to be thought and prepared. When information revolves around sensitive or complex topics. At the end of the lesson, we hope that you have benefited from the explanation. Follow us for the upcoming lessons, and do not forget to like and subscribe to the channel.